So I'm sure you have heard of this infamous heatless silk rod curler from TikTok. And also, why is it so expensive? Well, I went on the great world of eBay and actually found myself a dupe of the silk rod curler from TikTok. It looks the same to me. It should function the same. So let's get straight into trying it. It is said that a way to get the best result with a silk rod curler or silk ribbon curler, however you want to call it, it is to start off with freshly washed hair that is around 80% dry so that the curls can settle into shape overnight. So here is the curling rod thing. It also comes with two scrunchies and a clamp clip thing. And this is how long it will definitely suit long hair because my hair is pretty long, just below the bosoms. So to use the curler, you just need to split the hair into two sections and clamp it in place with a hair clip. This kit does come with some instructions just in case you need a little help like me. I also did find that by tying the opposite section helps to keep things in place as I wrap. Then taking a small section of your hair at the top, start to wrap it around the rod away from your face. Then work your way down, adding sections each time you wrap until all the hair is around the curler. The instructions doesn't really say to do this, but I thought I would fold the bottom onto the curler to really keep that hair in place, especially if you've got layered hair. Speaking of layered hair, I did find that if you've got layered hair, it can fall out. So what I did was I twisted each strand as I wrapped it around to help keep my layers in place. For seven pounds, the quality is actually really good. The curling rod is sturdy, but it's not uncomfortable at all. I honestly don't see why something like this can be so unnecessarily overpriced. It was also so comfy to sleep in, there's nothing at the back that can make it uncomfortable and if you're a side sleeper that wasn't a problem either. The next morning it's time to take it out and I was so impressed with how it held up overnight. Again it wasn't uncomfortable, the curls was bouncy, smooth, with no tangles or kinks in sight. The results looked as though I used a curling iron or even heated rollers. It gives a 90s blowout curls without the heat. So I was like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna be using this every single night. I am actually obsessed with the way this turned out. I cannot believe this is only seven pounds. Honestly, the quality is amazing. It kind of reminds me of like, you know when you go swimming and you don't wanna like drown? It's kind of like that kind of foam, so it's quite sturdy. I think it also depends on the width of the foam roller thing, but I will link down below what I use exactly from eBay. Honestly, it's such a bargain and you don't need to spend a ridiculous amount of money to get good results. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do give it a big fat thumbs up if you have and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more and I will see you on my next one.